Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name is David and this is a Magic Review. Hey, today we're gonna look at the Top It 180 from David Penn and World Magic Shop. All right, so the Top It 180, what is it? Uh, it's a Top It. Okay, it's a Top It. And if you don't know what a Top It is, uh, a Top It is a magic utility. Okay, it's a magic utility. It's been around for a long time, classic of magic, and it fits into your suit jacket. So this is suit jacket magic, okay? Right away, you should know that, suit jacket magic. If you don't wear a suit jacket, uh, you probably wouldn't get this. So this is kind of targeted at a group of magicians who do wear a suit jacket. But basically a top it is a utility device that's used by magicians. And what it does is it disposes of objects secretly. So it makes things vanish. Okay, it's like a black hole in your jacket. Things just disappear, okay? It plays a similar role to uh, maybe a pull or a holdout or a servant, okay? Things like that. Um, kind of replaces sleeving, okay? You don't really need a sleeve if you have a top it. Or, or lapping, okay? It's like lapping we do when we're seated. Uh, you'd use a top it standing up. And a long time ago, toppets were used by drifters and hustlers, and, they, and this was a little thing that they would call a poacher's pouch. Okay, it was, a, it was a thing in their jacket that allowed them to steal things, and then they could just hold up their hands in their jacket and go, what, what, I didn't take anything? Something like that, but uh, this, this uh, new invention that David Penn has come up with uh, is a wonderful rendition of the old classic toppet, and are able to do some really cool things with it. All right, so a couple questions we always ask about all of our magic reviews and the first of which is what's in the box. What's in the box? It's a cardboard long uh, folder-y thing, okay, a folder-y thing. <laughs> and inside that, you're, of course, you're gonna get the top at 180. Uh, you're gonna get a little card that um, has the link for the download video. Download video is about one hour and 13 minutes long. Is it what I thought? Um, no, not really. I mean, I kind of already knew what a top it was. I'd seen the Michael Lamar videos. Uh, I think I even have his pattern somewhere. Um, so just didn't really fully grasp the technology behind what David Penn was offering. Um, because really what this does is it is more than just a vanisher. More than just a vanisher because you can also ditch objects. Okay, now if you vanish an object, it's kind of disappearing into the front of your body. But with ditching an object, that would be uh, behind your back. So you could have an object and ditch it behind your back and when your hand comes back out, it's gone. And you could also do that in reverse. So instead of ditching an object, you can steal an object. So let's say you've got a uh, half dollar, okay? You can vanish it and it's gone. But reaching around behind your back, you can retrieve it. So you've stolen it back, okay? And if you wanted to, you can put it back behind your back and ditch it. So all of three of those techniques are available to you through the Top It 180. How are the angles on this? I think the angles are clean. Uh, they're the same angles you would see with any Top It, really. I mean, you're doing, a, you're doing a pitch, right? You're doing a pitch into your jacket. And so that is a misdirection along with some uh, skill from you, because you, you gotta be a good pitcher, okay? But as far as inspectability or anything like that, like, nobody should say, well, let me see your jacket. I mean, you should be able to open both the sides of your jacket, and I don't think people should be able to see anything initially. What's the overall quality and production value of the video? Um, David Penn has some live um, performances at a bar, and it looks like those are older shots, old foot, older footage. Um, but for most of the video, um, he's standing, he's well mic'd, he's using a stationary camera, uh, he's got a kind of a skyline behind him, he's performing on a table. Occasionally you'll get a couple of close-ups, there's no annoying background music. It is a well-produced video. As far as what's taught on the video, what's taught in the video, he's gonna go over two different things. He's gonna cover pitching, okay? So making your object vanish. I think that's the important part. That's the first part. Like anybody who's not already familiar with a top it, you need to learn how to pitch. You gotta learn how to make your objects vanish. So that's the primary thing that I think a top it does. It's, it's a vanishing device. And so David's gonna cover a lot of ground um, showing you techniques to how to pitch your objects into your jacket to make them disappear. He's also gonna talk about something that he calls spotlight focus. Spotlight focus is um, you watching your spectator's eyes so that you know where they are looking, okay? Because that's crucial. You wanna make your objects vanish 
when they're not looking directly at your hands or your jacket, right? You want, you want eye contact. But he also talks about spotlight focus as a way for you to see, okay, where your spectators are looking. Now I want them to look at my hands. Now I want them to look at the table. So he's gonna cover a lot of that, which I think is really key. And I'm glad he taught that on this video. I think it helps um, in your use of the topic to have this understanding of, okay, what's the highlighted feature right now? What's the spotlight on? Where is my spectator looking? Because everything you do, you kind of want to do in an offbeat. He's also going to go over several routines. Like I said, this video is an hour and 13 minutes long. So he's giving you lots of magical ideas. And even if you don't use these ideas, I think watching it will give you a lot of your own ideas. He's going to go over a billiard eight ball routine where he takes an eight ball and uh, smashes it down into like a little flat pancake. He's going to go over a coin and bottle routine. Uh, he's going to go through a, like a salt shaker and vanishing a salt shaker. He's going to go through a wine glass routine where he knocks the base off of a wine glass and then makes it appear back on. Uh, he's going to go through a couple of really cool uh, Sharpie marker tricks. And then there's some bonus footage at the end, which I think uh, is older footage. I think it came off of his 21st Century Toppet DVD. Is it well made? It is extremely well made. I know uh, sometimes toppets get put in to your coat with safety pins so that you can take it in and put it out. This is all done with Velcro and really what that does is it allows you to put Velcro in all your jackets and rather than pin and unpin this toppet from one jacket to the next, you can just transfer it easily with Velcro and it moves seamlessly, get it seamlessly, from one jacket to the next. How much practice does it require? Um, it does require practice. I mean, number one, you got to get the vanish down good. Like that's got to be key. And, and this that's going to be muscle memory, you doing it over and over again until you can do this. But you're also going to have to do it like I said, in an offbeat when no one's looking. So it's gonna have to be done uh, in a mirror, I would say, or get a really honest friend. And you're gonna have to practice that. Um, this isn't something that's self-working. This is something that looks magical because you practice. This is something that looks magical because of the time you put into it. So definitely, this is gonna take some practice. How much setup and reset is there? There's none. There's no setup, there's no reset, unless you're talking about moving it from one jacket to the next. Positives, all right, so what are the positives to the top at 180? Um, if you're just starting out, or you're a veteran in magic, David Penn's Top It 180 is what you should get. So easy to install or transfer to another jacket. With this miracle worker, you'll be vanishing every object you see. All right, so is it worth your money? Uh, it's $55. It is $55, but like I said, if, you're, if you wear a jacket anyway when you perform, chances are uh, you do it professionally. Okay, and you're gonna want something that's really well made, that you're gonna be able to put seamlessly into your jacket, okay? And like I said, it vanishes, you can steal with it, and you can ditch with it. So yeah, I think, man, who is this for? If you do table hopping, if you wear a jacket, you do dinner magic or uh, party magic, and you, like I said, you wear a jacket, you want this. You wanna be able to steal things, ditch things, vanish things all the time. This makes it possible. I can't recommend this any higher. Okay, so one more thing about purchasing. Uh, when you go out to look for the Top It 180, you're gonna notice that it comes in a left-handed version or a right-handed version, okay? And you're gonna say, well, which one should I order? You wanna order the one that you throw with. So if you throw right-handed or throw left-handed, get that one. Does that make sense? If you throw with your left hand, buy the left-handed version. If you throw with your right hand, by the right-handed version. All right, so that's pretty much everything I can say about the top at 180 from David Penn and World Magic Shop. Of course, I wanna thank Murphy's Magic Supplies for allowing me to have this so that I could do the review for you. And if you would like to purchase it for yourself, you can find it from your very favorite Murphy's Magic dealer.